In today's video, I'm going to show you how to safely overclock your GPU for gaming in 2024. This optimization is completely safe and work with your any PC or laptop. And guys, I suggest you to follow this whole video. So with wasting my time, let's dive straight into it. So guys, before going toward this optimization, I suggest you to always refresh your Windows file. So for the press Windows are together from your keyboard and type your percentage, temp, percentage and press enter and make sure to delete all this temporary or junk file of your windows so press ctrl there from your keyboard right click here go for delete and delete all these files from here after that click cancel and cancel these files now in the next step you need to download msa afterburner on your pc and we are going to utilize this application safely on our windows for our gpu so guys, you need to download this file, make sure to download the same exact one, you can find out the link in the description, simply join my discord server, after that go for this download tab and there you will find out this download link. Click on this link and download the MS Afterburner on your PC. Once you download and install the MS Afterburner, here you will find out this kind of the interface. Now the most simple and the easiest method for the MS Afterburner, that is you need to go for this overclock scanner, click on this button and this will start scanning all the settings of your windows, of your GPU and find the best settings for you. You will find out here the scan button, so click here and this will start scanning all your GPU and this will usually take around 15 to 20 minutes and that's a lot. This will check different value on your PC with different temperature with different core clock and memory clock settings and find the best one for you. So guys I suggest you to use the manual method because that is faster and also the way more stable for your GPU. So guys for that click on the stop button and stop this scanning. Click on the close and close of this window. So now in the very first step of the manual method you need to go straight towards this fan section. There you will find out the power limit. If you increase the power limit of your GPU, that will directly improve the performance of your GPU, but also this will increase the temperature of your GPU. Because you are getting more performance out of your GPU, that means more temperature. So therefore, it is completely safe you simply turn on the settings onto the highest level. After that, go for this on button and guys set it on to the automatic. This will automatically find the best fan speed for you and lower the temperature of your GPU. Now here is the most important part of your GPU for overclocking that is the core clock settings and memory clock settings. I suggest you to change the settings of the core clock then test that settings in the game. If that is stable simply increase the increment of 20 again and repeat the step again and again. I'm gonna show you the settings in the one step. So guys like you need to go for core clock, go for this value and simply type a 20 and press enter. Now you need to test the settings in the game and if that is stable for you, you need to again come for the core clock settings and get incremented with 20. Now this time it is 40 megahertz so now again test it in the fortnite again come here on the settings again increment it onto the 60 and guys by the way you can also find out the best core clock and memory clock settings on google like you can simply open up your browser find out the name of your gpu so you need to go for google and type best msi settings for rtx 3060 you need to use your gp model after that scroll down and there you will find out where it you need to open up this article and there you will find out the best settings according to your gpu to gpu you can simply use the settings and this is very stable by the way you can also read here these comments and reviews of people after using the settings and guys after applying all the settings on your gpu you need to click on the supply button or you can simply also save this profile like click on the save button select out here the profile and guys that's it now you need to simply minimize the MS Afterburner every time for overclocking your GPU before playing any game. And guys, that's it. I hope so you love this video. Please make sure to drop a like on this video and tell me in the comment section about this video optimization. So guys, see you in the next video.